Hello, my loves. Welcome back to the vlog channel. I just got done working out in case you can't tell. Um, I look, oh my God, I just took myself a hot mess. I um, am about to sit down and edit tomorrow's main channel video. <laughs> Fun story, I had edited a vlog, it was so fabulous, and I exported everything for some reason in my head. I was like, okay, I've uploaded this, this vlog, I just haven't like said it live yet. So I erased it, emptied the trash can, and deleted all of the footage. Yeah, I definitely had not uploaded it yet. So there's that. That's why you didn't get a vlog um, the other day. Because I had been vlogging. But I'm just losing my marbles. I also just got done working out, so I'm like all over the place. What's tomorrow's makeup? Makeup tutorial. That's what we'll, we'll name this raw file. Um, but I'm going to show you guys my ball decor because that was what I showed you in the last one. It looks so good in this house. I don't have like any super crazy decorations. I go very subtle with my fall decorations because like as far as like decor goes, like tchotchkes, wreaths, trays, anything like that, when it comes to seasonal decorations, I don't know why, but it gives me severe anxiety. And so I like have subtle decorations out for fall so that I can kind of go a little bit crazy during the winter, like, or for Christmas. Um, so I'll show it to you guys. It looks so good. It's like I said, subtle, cute, fall. Um, but I am like really proud of it because all the stuff I found is like from Dollar Store, Big Lots, Dollar Tree, Dollar General. Like none of it costs, like the most expensive piece of decor I own is probably $25. And I'll show you guys all of that. But I've got to get editing this video before Sam gets home. He's mountain biking with his friends. That is like, I am so jealous of them. Him and his friends have been mountain biking for like five minutes. Okay, it's actually been like a month, month and a half. I have been working out religiously since May, I believe, to September, and I've lost 14 pounds. I think like each of them have lost like 10 pounds, and they've been working out for like a month and a half. And I said it in the last video, like, that I erased, worth it. I, it's harder for women to lose weight because we have babies. Worth it. Worth it if that means that one day I can carry a little baby. I will take it. But like, couldn't it be just like a little bit of a struggle for them? Like, couldn't it be a little bit hard? All right, I really gotta get started editing this. So I'll check you guys later when I look more normal. All right, friends, so I just finished up editing this video. It took so much longer, excuse me, I have hiccups than I thought. Y'all. <laughs> Editing is so time consuming. Literally been editing that video for two hours. It's 10 minutes finished. Yeah, um, and I'm pretty fast at it. So I wanted to show you guys, I don't know why I look so red. I wanted to show you guys the fall decor really quick. So please ignore our chaotic house. Um, but something I was showing you guys. Okay, so the table runner is from Target. The two green, and the reason I'm telling you this is because I can't link it for you guys. The two green pumpkins are from the Dollar Tree. These are from Big Lots. Like these actual little, what are they called? They're like a, oh, it's like a full piece. I'm not speaking well today. Um, those are from Big Lots. And then the vase is actually from Dollar Tree spray painted gold. So. This whole little setup here is real cute. And then over here, I got those from Dollar General last year. That little gold plate. It's like a leaf from Big Lots with a fall candle. Big Lots this year. Um, Dollar General last year. Sam always does this. He like push, pushes stuff together because he just gets like annoyed with it. But like, I don't care. Like this, I still have to get flowers for this and it was like lined up and he just like pushes it back. It's so annoying. <laughs> um, this little globe, I think it came from Kirkland's. Um, some little flowers. They're not like fall flowers, but they're fall colors. And then I have these pillows. Well, they're actually pillow covers um, that I have for like pillow inserts. 
there. And I think that's majority of it. I do have, let's see. Um, oh my gosh, there's laundry everywhere. These are from a Dollar Tree, I think. Dollar Tree glass. This is from Big Lots. Like there's legit no reason to pay a lot for decor. And then, oh Lord, what's in here? Oh, I don't even have that much in here besides dirty dishes. I just have our little like coffee bar here with a little pumpkin that I have from Dollar Tree. So see, subtle, it's all affordable, but it's like, it's real cute. You know what I mean? Okay, so Sam is at his parents right now. He had to go fill out some paperwork, um, something for something, <laughs> I don't know. Um, and I told him I was gonna have the dishes done by the time he got back. So I need to get on that. Ooh. So I'm gonna tell you guys the story I was telling Sam. I already mentioned it on my Instagram story. I want to get Botox on the 26th, and that cannot come fast enough. So, today at work, I solved a crime. That's what I told I said, like, we solved a mystery. And the police officer literally just bust out laughing. And I was like, okay, in my, like, I didn't mean to say mystery. I meant to say crime. Basically, at work today, I'm trying to do this while not like shaking you guys around. This girl, to put it long story short, this girl walked by our like front of our building and threw something in the grass and I was like well that's rude of her to litter like that and so a few minutes went by and I went to pick up whatever it was that she littered and I saw that police officers had pulled her and her boyfriend over they were walking and so I looked down and she had thrown an ID down the stairs and so I was like this is sketchy so I went and got my manager and I was like come outside with me like I need to figure out if this is the right thing to do. Like, should I take this ID to the police officer? Long story short, we did. And that man was connected to a string of robberies. Like, good Samaritan. Someone called me Mariska, one of my friends on Insta. She was like, oh my God, you're like Mariska. And I was like, I don't even know if I'm saying her name right. From Law and & Order, and I was like, yes. Yes, I feel like that today. So I solved a mystery, is what I said. But it felt really good, because I was like, listen, loser, like, he apparently has been robbing a bunch of, I think they said it was like motels and hotels. And they were like, we've been looking for him. And I was able to confirm it. And they already had him in the back of their cop car. When I walked over, they were just trying to confirm who he was. And it was just taking a really long time, because he didn't have an ID on him. Well, he, he had, an ID on him he had just gotten rid of it so it felt really good to pat on the back to get that one done so now we are going to what are we getting I'm totally blanking Japanese, Japanese. Food. yeah we're getting Japanese food for the night and then that's all we're doing I don't know do you have any plans I haven't showed you guys have you seen who's it who's in the car he's so pretty Doug you have fans there are people who watch my Insta stories and they say, I'm only here for dog. And I'm like, girl, me too. Look at that sweet face. Oh my goodness. Got the window. Oh yeah. Oh my God. Look at, look at, look at him. Look at him. Oh. <laughs> I love him so much. Hey guys. Okay, so I'm going to make a recipe. Um, Hold on. I will link it below for y'all. Um, I found it on, I think it's like cook with Mima's or cook with Mimi's bake with, I'm not sure. I'll leave the full recipe to her and her Instagram and stuff down in the description bar below. But I'm going to make this yummy yogurt parfait. And I did change out some of the ingredients so that they're a little bit more healthy. All right. So for the yogurt parfait, all you need <clears throat> is a tray with the parchment paper. That's going to be your base. And then... I got light vanilla non-fat yogurt, <clears throat> Yoplait strawberry yogurt. You need blueberries, you need cut up strawberries, and then I got gluten-free all natural uh, granola. So hers didn't have like, I don't think hers was that healthy. It might've been, it just didn't call for like, non-fat yogurt and all that stuff. So I'm thinking she used regular, but I mean, it doesn't make any difference.
So this is the final result. Yummy. I'm gonna freeze it overnight. It says freeze for at least four hours, so I'm gonna freeze it overnight. So cannot wait to see how it tastes. I'll let you guys know in the morning. Good morning, y'all. I am about to, oh, that's heavy. That is real heavy. Try the yogurt parfait. Oh my gosh, that's not gonna cut easy. Let's just cut one. Are you trying to use a knife? Because you should probably try to use like a spatula and like push it down instead of trying to solve it. Honey, come here. Let's just try. Let's oh, just you come here. Oh, is he ready to go outside? Oh my gosh, that is so good. Oh, <laughs> Sam's not dressed. Um, I will have to let it thaw a little bit before I can cut it. This is really good. Oh, that's cold. That's cold to eat first thing in the morning. Whew. It's good though. Okay, can you scoot like over? You're not dressed. No, I'm using the wrong knife. You see how that one slid right through so much easier? Okay. So it's freaking delicious. All right, guys. So that is it for this vlog. Uh, go ahead and click the subscribe button if you're new here. We'll see you guys next time.